Hello and welcome to another video tutorial for the Mac by TechnologyNovice.com. Today I am going to show you how to scan from an HP all-in-one printer to the Mac. What I use is a program that is included on every Mac called Image Capture. Um, it is located in the Applications folder and it is a program that is made by Apple. So I will open Image Capture here and when I do that you will see that both my printers um, are showing up. I have two HPs. Um, the one I'm going to use is this one. So I will click that and we see that it says trying to open scanner session um, and that no paper is loaded. And that is because the scan mode says document feeder. The thing, the item that I'm trying to scan is located um, on the flatbed. So I just have to click that and switch to flatbed. And it tells me that the scanner is warming up. Takes a couple seconds here to get it going. And there we go, I get my overview scan. Now this is not the actual scan, this is just a preview where it is showing me what my final scan is going to look like. Here I can take these um, edges and I can reduce the scan size or increase the scan size depending on um, on the document that I'm scanning. And in this case, it's scanning a little bit more than I want, so I'll reduce it a bit. Um, and then I have a couple of choices here. I can change the resolution, um, the size, the rotation angle. I can also choose what folder I want the scan to go to. Um, today I am scanning some recipes, and so um, I have it going to my recipes folder. The name of the, the file um, that I want to call it, so I'm going to have it call, call it uh, Panini Recipes. And the format, I can choose PDF, uh, JPEG, if I'm doing pictures, um, different things like that. So I will leave it in PDF because this I want to be PDF and everything else is just fine. So I will go ahead and press scan. Again, the scanner is warming up. And there we go. It's scanning the document and when it is finished that document will magically appear in my recipes folder and my scan will be complete. Thank you for uh, following along with this Mac tutorial by TechnologyNovice.com. Be sure to stop by TechnologyNovice.com for more great Mac tutorials. Thank you.